Hello again, my name is Kevin. You're watching Leatherneck Prepper. So in my quest to pick up a tire inflator, which I've had a lot of issues trying to get the one that I want, I end up having to switch over to Milwaukee just so I could get one that would fill up the tires on my truck. I wanted the DeWalt because the DeWalt was what I already was using. I didn't have to buy any more batteries or chargers or anything else like that. But since they are on a national back order, apparently, at least at Home Depot and Lowe's, because nobody in my area has them, and I couldn't order it either on Amazon or from um, Lowe's or Home Depot, I just went ahead and picked up the M18 air inflator so I could air up the tires on my truck. My truck, uh, being it's a diesel, I have to have maximum of 80 PSI, standard is just 60, but it's a lot better than using the compressor that I had to wheel out and it's a smaller compressor and just did not, it was a, a 45 minute ordeal to air up one tire. And this will do it all at one time. So while I was looking for this particular item, I saw this mini, uh, uh, oh, I can't think of what they're called, inverter that runs off the M18 battery. It has a USB regular, a USB-C for charging phones, and it's running this light that's actually right above me, giving me the light. Okay, turn it on. Actually, just so you can see it actually is the light. See, I just turned it off. I turn that back on. Light comes back on. It's charging my Olight, which already is fully charged because I did that yesterday, but still, it would be charging it. So that's 110 volt light, whatever it takes for the uh, uh, phone to charge, because I'm actually charging my phone off of this right now, the same phone that I'm using to make the video, and the Olight, all one battery. Now this is the 5 milliamp battery, so it's, uh, or the 5 amp battery, I'm sorry, uh, 5 amp battery, uh, it's a little bit more expensive, but it gives me a little bit more power. And that's exactly what I wanted. So just another way to charge things if we happen to lose power. And I don't want to dig out, because it's not going to be that long, I don't want to dig out the um, uh, um, my EcoFlow Delta. And it's only going to be off half hour or so, which usually in this area, you're not losing power for long. Just keep a light on. This is perfect. It also keeps things charged. So, just something else that uh, you can throw in your toolbox. Now, if I'm not mistaken, I think I paid $99 for that, plus the price of the batteries. So, I believe this item here was $99. Anyhow, hope you guys got something out of it. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. If you have any comments, by all means, tell me what you think. And remember, death will smile at everybody, but Marines smile back. Have a good one, guys.